Join me on my trip to Chicago where I speak at Wheaton Academy. All right, just landed here in Chicago. My flight got delayed, so it is 3.45 a.m. And I'll be speaking tomorrow morning at the uh, Wheaton Academy, which I'm excited about, but uh, I'm not gonna get a lot of rest between now and then. But uh, I'm excited to have you along the journey with me. All right, good morning. Got three hours sleep last night. Could have got a fourth, but wanted to get the day started right in God's word with a little exercise. We've got a long day ahead of us, so I need to keep this body strong. This shirt here used to be a little bit looser. It's getting tight, and it's not because I'm gaining muscle. So we want to stay off the path of the easy street, getting fluffy, and we want to stay strong for the Lord, and that happens right here. Not only did I get a chance to speak at Wheaton Academy, but I also got a tour of Wheaton College, which was amazing. <laughs> Snow on the ground. All right, this is Fine Arts Center. All right, it's game time. Here we go. Wheaton Academy, Chicago, Illinois. I've watched him lead in unbelievable settings with thousands upon thousands of people. He's been on Netflix, uh, NBC, uh, as a, a, a American Ninja Warrior, Beastmaster. And this guy's a stud when it comes to the physical prowess. He was direct commissioned in the U.S. Army Reserve as a chaplain and was one of the first, probably only chaplains, to be nominated in the Special Forces. Week one, I needed Brandon to show me the ropes. Week two, I needed a ranger to sacrifice everything so that I could continue to carry on. And week three, I needed that floater to come and alleviate the burden of pain that I couldn't carry anymore on my own. You know what's true for all of us? Is that wherever God's calling you, chances are it's not gonna be an easy path. And if it's a clear path, chances are it's someone else's path. Because Jesus said, take the narrow road. Wide is the gate, the easiest way to destruction, and plenty of people on it. The narrow is the gate, the hard is the way, and few people find it. You're gonna have a hard challenge in your life that you'll never be able to accomplish in and of your own strength. But God has uniquely called you and set you apart for a special work. You are his workmanship in Christ Jesus, created for good works. But you'll never be able to do it in your own strength, and you'll never be able to do it without other people. To speak in the chapel, uh, I, I coax them into also speaking with this group as well. Gentlemen. This is the Wheaton Academy football team, and I had a chance to talk to them about pressing on when things got hard. All right, we just finished uh, speaking here at Wheaton Academy yeah. to, to the entire school and the football team. I got Carrie here from Beeson Divinity School, one of the finest Southern Baptist preachers. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me, what denomination? Evangelical are you now? free. <laughs> okay. yeah. Same thing, undercover Baptist, all right? And then I got Jim, this is my boss. All right, guys, how'd it go today? How'd it go? It was awesome. Yeah. Excellent. Great. This is a great school, good kids. Good coach right here. That's right. Great coach. He wants to have James with us. Hey, he wants to have Gary with us. Coach got fired up today, too, man. These kids are lucky to have him. All right, check out Wheaton Academy, amazing school. We'll see ya. All right, just finished talking to the students here at Wheaton Academy. Had a great time, what a great group, what a great school. Chicago, such a friendly place, man. Beautiful city, a little cold, but friendly. And the airport's looking a little more alive here now that we're traveling during normal hours. But uh, I'm headed back and uh, I, I just enjoyed talking to the students today about uh, really having God in their lives when they're pursuing the mission and the, and the dreams that are in their hearts and how important that is. And also to have other people in their corner that can support them as they pursue those streams and do the things that God's calling them to do. And uh, the same is true for you and me. All right, keep pressing on, cheers. All right, that's it from Chicago, headed back to Miami. Thanks for joining us.